Hello everyone, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create a bonded paginator since it was requested by one of our subscribers in Bicycle server. So, without further ado, let's hop into the video. Alright, so, first of all, I'm going to make it as a function in a file, alright? So, uh, I'm going to create a new file, name it like bottom paginator .js, alright? So, uh, if you want it, if you want to make a package using this code, uh, it's allowed, you can do that, but please give just credit, at least. So, uh, first I'm gonna need a message button and message action row, so, const message, message button, and message action row, right here. Equal require disco buttons. Alright. If you don't have disco buttons, you will just npm i install disco buttons. And soon you know be I am gonna be making a v13 uh, series, so you don't you won't even need uh, disco buttons. Uh, for now, because I'm on v12, so I'm gonna just use it. So I'm gonna need ms as well. So require ms npm ims all right so const paginator equal async message all right and pages make an our function let's go here do module dot exports equal paginator all right let's now stop the work so, oops, I think, wait, here, all right, so, first I want to say that uh, if there is no message or channel, I want to say something like uh, the channel is not accessible, or something like that, so I'm going to do message, if no message, uh, or... Let's do it like this, the channel, alright, throw new error, right, saying, uh, like, please provide a message, or, like, is it, this is a custom error, alright, so you, you, you just want to remind yourself if you forgot, alright, so you're going to just put something like, uh, uh, provide a message or something like that. Provide a message to access the channel, maybe something like that. All right, all right. And if there is no pages, basically, all right, I want to throw uh, a new editor again saying uh, pages or please provide pages, all right. So, uh, now I want to put let page, like one page is equal to zero, and I want to create like two buttons uh, and a row, so, uh, const button one, equal new message button, and then let's put, if you want to set an emoji maybe, alright, so let me just set an emoji. And here, let me put one, like, uh, here, all right, and then dot set ID, just put a random ID, like, all right, uh, dot set style now, let's make it green, all right, now I'm going to just Create it again, another one here. And I'm gonna just change this. Uh, 
and change the ID for sure. Alright, now just create a row, constrol equal new message action row dot add components and I'm gonna just put here an array and put both of the buttons. Alright. So now instead of just doing uh, like message dot uh, components uh, other a zero and like that I'm gonna just create two other buttons alright it's not that hard and I'm gonna just make them disabled alright here oops I'm gonna just change the IDs and the set disabled true you don't you don't even have to put uh, true all right perfect now we got uh, the buttons and the row and everything we need so uh, also I need to create another row sorry here just here let's let's name it dead row all right and let's put those uh, here. Let's grab it here. All right, perfect. So now we got the two rows: row the alive one and the dead one. All right. So now I want to uh, do const current page. I want to have a current page. So const page all right equal uh, await message dot channel will send uh, the embed that is gonna be basically pages zero that is the first embed and components uh, components I mean that are gonna be the row the first one here all right perfect now i want to create a filter all right so uh const filter i don't know why i'm using const i should be using that but it doesn't really matter i'm gonna just uh do like this creating a filter here so basically only uh those here all right we don't want to show an uh, interaction field for the user who into the message uh, author so I'm gonna just do it in another way you're gonna see it right now so it should be including the beta ID that basically is the button all right so now I want to create a collector, so course call equal await current page dot create button uh, collector and I'm gonna just put here the filter and I'm gonna put the time. Alright, for how long can it last? Like can it, can it respond to the user? So let's put as example 10 minutes, all right, or five minutes is good. Actually, for a test, let's put it 10 seconds for for because I'm just testing right now. All right, so now call dot on collect. So once it collects, all right, uh, button here, all right. So first I want to do button dot reply dot defer in any case uh, and then if the button clicker dot clicker dot user dot id is not equal equal to the message dot author dot id I want to just return alright so only the message author can use it all right so now I want to let me just do here if 
if the bottom ID is equal, equal to this, that is basically button one, I want to make page equal to page and this sign that means uh, like bigger or smaller, All right? And then here page pages dot length right minus one. All right. Else, if the button ID is uh, the other one, basically button two here. Uh, where? Also, by the way, if you didn't understand what I did here, I'm basically just going to the next page, but uh, in the same time I'm checking if there is a next page. If there is no next page, you're gonna restart from the beginning of page one. Because if there is like five pages and I'm at, five, uh, at page five, so there is not there is no one after it. So if I just react it again, it got just restart and get from page one. All right. So else if button dot id is equal, equal to this one. All right. I want to do a page is equal to page plus one, all right, uh, oh, wait, basically I mean the first one, because the first one is the bot, uh, but the button is going to the back, all right, so if it's one, go, go to five, that's what I mean, I just got confused for a second, so here I'm gonna just do the same, but with plus, so it just gets, uh, edit right perfect so uh, here after all of this I want to just do current page dot edit and the embed is going to be pages dot uh, like the page basically there is number so I'm gonna just get it from the array all right so component row. Also, uh, also the source code is uh, provided in the Discord server. But keep in mind, if you just copy paste it without uh, understanding anything, it will just fail. Right. So we finished here the collect part. So I'm gonna just go uh, call dot on and right here. Uh, if current page, uh, if there is no current page, basically, I will like this, delete it. I don't know if you guys know about delete it, but it's actually something. Uh, and I did, I really discovered it not so far away. I didn't really know that delete it exists. Like I knew delete exists, but delete it not really. Anyways, so uh, current page dot edit embed pages page all right and then component is gonna be the deadline that is basically the dead row. All right, so now I'm gonna just return the current page. All right, finally now. I can just create a file right now. Here, let me just go to fun, uh, paginator, like button, paginator, .js. All right, let me just put this, put here, button, paginator. Let me just actually yeah you gonna just need to put here paginator const paginator equal require this file button paginator that we just created that has the function all right so I'm gonna just put it like this button paginator perfect that's it so far so all I have to do right now is just create an embed equal new discord of message embed 
here the subtitle page one all right let's create like four three of them yeah i don't know too much to be honest here we go all right and just easily you're gonna just do paginator message and uh, let's create here let's put let pages equal and i'm gonna put all the pages i created um, here as you can see and i'm gonna just put pages here that's it that's how i create created it and show you how it works let me just now show you in the server all right Here we are, as you can see, if I'm pressing, it's just going here, page three just went to the back again. If I press here, we're gonna go to page three and after 10 seconds, as you can see, just stop there, as you can see. And see over here, that's it so far. As I told you, uh, it just checks for uh, for the pages basically if there is one after it or no or one before it or no so if you got any question don't hesitate joining our discord survey you can find the link in the description thank you for watching so that was it and ciao